Forecast News 18. Weather from where you live. We've been watching this area to our west and northwest all afternoon, and now the clouds really bubbling up. See right here this line just east of I-57. Well, those storms, those are storms that are rapidly going up right now. And as we look northwest from I-65, notice it looks like just a wall of cauliflower, if you will, on the horizon. And these are the storms forming. Watch them right here blow up. And they are beginning to move to the east and southeast. So I wouldn't be a bit surprised if we start getting into a few warnings soon because these are really intensifying pretty quickly. And gradually they're going to form a line that will move through the area. And then once it gets southeast of Lafayette, it's going to tend to gust out. But there is a severe weather risk this evening. And these are going way up. And they're pretty organized storms too. A lot of these are tilting a little bit. And when storms tilt like that, that means that they're longer lasting and they organize and can produce more in the way of severe weather. So you can see how it tilts like that. That's a sign we've got a little bit of shear. The winds are a little strong as you go up in the atmosphere. So that's why we've got some severe weather risk this evening. In addition, the high heat and humidity are also uh, fueling them as well. But after this goes through, the cold front goes through, um, the rain will shut off, so some rain tomorrow, and then it turns a little cooler. But there is heat down the road. In fact, I think we'll have more 90s towards mid-August. The storm outlook for this evening, though, there is some hail risk, but the main threat is wind and also potential of some localized flash flooding because there's so much water to squeeze out of this very hot, humid air mass. So yellow, slight risk of severe weather. That's pretty much everybody. It means scattered severe storms possible. The risk, slightly less down here in the southeast because, like I said, as the line goes down here, it will tend to gust out and gradually weaken. But even tomorrow, there's a marginal risk. That means an isolated severe storm or two. So we're still going to have some scattered showers and thunderstorms around tomorrow as many of you are headed back to school, including Lafayette schools. 70 tomorrow morning as you're headed to the bus. Still some scattered rain around. And even tomorrow afternoon, some scattered showers and thunderstorms around and muggy. 82 degrees, but the wind gradually turning to the northwest as the cold front goes through. There's your line of storms developing, and here it goes moving through the area this evening before it gusts out as it moves into our southeast. But even tomorrow, notice a few showers tomorrow morning and through the day, some additional scattered showers and thunderstorms coming through. And remember, there is still a marginal risk for severe weather tomorrow. The main threat, wind. Secondary threat would be hail. And the risk for this evening, pretty much now till about 10 o'clock tonight. 82 tomorrow with humid. 81 Wednesday, mid 80s Thursday and humid. Humid Friday with some storms and then it cools off a little bit for the weekend. Okay, Chad, umbrellas tonight if you're heading out anywhere, you right? Bet. Okay. Mm -hmm.